Diving into idioms, unraveling, dyeing the wool. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore an interesting phrase, dyeing the wool. This idiom might sound straightforward, but it's packed with meaning and history. Let's unravel its secrets together. Dyeing the wool literally refers to the process of changing the color of wool using dyes. However, as an idiom, it has a different connotation. It's used to describe a situation where someone is trying to change something's inherent qualities, often in a deceptive or superficial way. Think of it as trying to alter something's natural state, much like changing the color of wool. This idiom has roots in the textile industry, where dyeing wool was a common practice. Historically, the process was used to enhance or change the appearance of woolen fabrics. This historical context helps us understand the metaphor better. Just like dyeing wool changes its appearance, using this phrase implies changing or hiding the true nature of something. To grasp this idiom better, Let's look at some examples. The politician was accused of dyeing the wool when he changed his stance on key issues just before the election. Companies often engage in dyeing the wool by exaggerating the benefits of their products. These examples show how the phrase is used to imply deceit or superficial change. There are other idioms with similar meanings, like pulling the wool over someone's eyes or a wolf in sheep's clothing. These also revolve around the theme of deception or disguise, drawing from the versatile nature of wool in metaphors. We hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, dyeing the wool, and its use in everyday language. Remember, idioms add color and depth to our conversations, much like dye adds vibrancy to wool. Stay curious, and keep exploring the rich tapestry of the English language. See you in the next video.